Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. In this video we're going to be discussing all things semi-annual sale. These are last minute tips, tricks, and advice you guys for having your best time at this semi-annual sale winter 2020 happening at Bath & Body Works. <laughs> okay you guys please be sure to subscribe to my channel and uh, let's get started. Okay, this is just a reminder because I'm still getting um, DMs from you guys. You're unsure of um, the dates. You're unsure about the coupons. You have questions about budgeting, about what to buy, what to look for, what's going to be there. So I'm here to help you as much as possible because I'm looking forward to semi-annual sale. It is one of my favorite sales. This is the perfect time to stock up. If you ever were just going to splurge a little bit and treat yourself, but still keep it, you know, within reason as far as affordability, then yes, I would say semi-annual sale is your best bet. So let's start with coupons. Raise your hand if you've received a coupon. Notice my hand didn't go up. Well, I haven't received a coupon. And I'm a little sad about that. Who knows? But by the time you guys have watched this video, I may have gotten one in the mail. Hopefully, like seriously, like I want my coupon. Like where are my coupons? I usually get like lots of coupons. Where are my coupons? Now, if you guys have coupons, hooray for you because like seriously, that's great. That's a great way to save your money, okay? And get the best deals. Pair the coupon. I cannot say this enough. Pair the coupon with 75% off items. Please look for those items first. I know that I have made a video like this before. I know you guys have been watching my SAS videos. Thank you so much. And it may seem repetitive, but these are for the people who are newly joining on and want to learn more about semi-annual sale. So that's, you know, why I'm here and making this video. And you guys are reaching out to me on Instagram, on my DMs. So I want to help you. And you, and a lot of you have the same, you know, questions. So I'm like, let me just make a video. <laughs> let me check in with you guys and make a video. Back to coupons. I'm hoping that you know, even at the last minute, they will still send an email coupon because they've got almost a month to get some coupons out to people. But I like to shop like the first day and then possibly check throughout that week, you know, and then maybe take a break, kind of maybe take it easy and then pop back in to check and see, hmm, have any of the 50% off items gone to 75% off? So yes, hold on to your coupon. Don't lose your coupon. Pack it up the night before and have it ready to go. And on your coupon, it will show you around the time that I'm thinking that semi-annual sale will be over. I believe it has a January 23rd or 24th date. So yes, and actually on that coupon, there are a list of some of the throwbacks that are headed back our way. I did a video where I did um, a preview, a semi-annual sale preview walkthrough of the items that they're setting out. The stores are setting the stuff out early, you guys. It's just that they're not at semi-annual sale prices. So don't you touch that stuff. Don't you get that stuff right now. Just wait until semi-annual sale because you're not sure if, for example, they've got some true blue stuff out there, you're going to pay full price. But if you wait until semi-annual sale, it may be in the 75% off table rounders. So if you can, just hold on. Now, if you absolutely cannot wait, well, then that's up to you. But hey, my best advice is to just hold on just a few more days until, you know, semi-annual sale. So they've got True Blue, um, they've got Coco Shea. Check out that video, you guys, because I show it all there. And then um, I've seen oh, Pear Berry, Dark Kiss, oh my goodness, French Lavender and Honey, and then all the Retired Scents, the Cucumber Melon, and oh, I'm just so excited. Now, the... That new bakery line that has a raspberry jam donut, people are saying that that is for after semi-annual sale. And I'm like, what? And then some people say, no, their stores are starting to get it now in preparation for semi-annual sale. If that line is there, you know it's going to be sought after. And you guys know probably it's going to start at 50% off. It probably will not reach the 75% off tables right away. So you never know. Or maybe by week two or week through, week through really, week three, they may start to end up on those 75% off tables and rounders. So, you know, now um, someone said, are you getting the new collection? 
of course, I'm getting the new collection. I've done a video on it and everything. It's so yummy. You guys know I love my gourmand scents, so yes. And I like the packaging. Some people were saying that it has like a Dollar Tree sort of look to it. I don't mind that. It looks good. It looks cute. It looks fun. And hey, I'm all for it. I want the candles. I want the body care. So if it's not at semi-annual sale, then I will be tracking down my store to see when they get it. So yes, let me know if you've started to see them at your store or, you know, whatnot. And I've already done my wish list video. Refer back to that video for the actual specific things I'm going to be on the lookout for. And then what else did I want to talk to you guys um, about? Oh, budgeting. There are some people that are buying gift cards to make sure that they only stick to the gift cards and then once they've used up their gift cards, then that's it. That's a good way to keep yourself on budget and keep yourself on track um i have a gift card as well and so i will not have to put out any you know out of pocket things i won't have to pay any cash or you know any money to enjoy semi-annual sale this time and so i'm really really happy about that another thing is I'm probably going to be sticking to more uh, fragrance mist. That's another way to hone in your budget is to stick to certain forms. You may not need, uh, and figure out what you really need. You may not need, you know, car sanitizers and, you know, um, pocket back holders and all those sorts of things. You may just want to focus on maybe just body care and maybe just candles or body care and candles and wallflowers or something like that. But please, please, please stick to your 75% off. For example, I want to look for more fragrance sprays because honestly, in order to save money, you can always get a lotion um, from Walmart that's non-scented and use that to help layer your scent rather than buying the all all the forms at Bath and Body Works. Um, these are the tricks that I have, you guys. You know, put on a regular lotion and then spritz with a Bath and Body Works spray, or maybe just focus on getting the fragrance mist and the creams and not the shower gels. You don't need everything in every form. But like I said, this is a perfect time to stock up. There are people that shop this sale and won't shop again until the June semi-annual sale. So, you know, this is all good tips for budgeting and everything. Remember, bring your mask, bring your hand sanitizers, bring your coupons, okay? Shop around at different stores. Don't just stay in your local, you know, little small store. Venture out to the malls. This is a perfect time to have a little mini road trip, a mini one, a mini affordable road trip that you can handle and it's okay. And um, I particularly have a mall um, not close to me that we have to drive out to that has a Bath and Body Works upstairs and they have a Bath and Body Works downstairs. They have two Bath and Body Works in one mall. I know, mind blown. <laughs> so yes, you guys. So I'm excited. I can't wait to see your hauls if you want me to check them out, if you have a channel as well. So please leave me your information. The hauls are going to be headed your way, you guys. So stay tuned for that. That's why you got to subscribe so you can see all of the wonderful goodies. And remember, it's okay to stick to a budget. It's okay to, you know, have a certain amount. And then when you're done, you're done. Let me know what you guys think. Okay, I will see you next time. Bye, guys.